Ja, ja Asi zit op een eerder kom. Yes, live stream it. Ja. I'll be high, I promise. Alright, Jane. Right now. Uh, is it? Dat is het op je radio hoort. Ja. Denk jullie hier die quattro en die wat die andere die wel eens gebruik om een groter achterwind te Oh, I stream Frank, uh, yes, but Frank and Sorex is on YouTube. Uh, yeah, but it's not on YouTube, nie. it's not on Twitch. With Twitch, uh, yeah. Twitch. 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 Uh, you see, he's no life. Yeah, actually, uh, life. What's the title? Title is GT Sport SA Rally X Race Day R4 live stream with exclusive interview with the GT Sport admins. But anyways, welcome to the stream, everybody. My name is Frank and Torix Gaming here, and today we have some special guests here tonight with me. Uh, it's the guys from GT Sport SA, the admins, Mr. Werner and Mr. Blixenpi. How are you guys doing? Good in yourself, buddy. Yeah, I've been already. The whole bus is still to win like Dorsal, but you guys finally. We gave each other chance to talk first. Yeah, yeah so. Yeah, oh, this more service, service scarf. Yes, yeah, so we are actually waiting for Mr. Um, Papa Jer, but he's so quiet and so. So, um, how can I say it? So uh, sneaky. Yeah, so sneaky. <laughs> so, yes, we are at round number four of the uh, Rally X Championship. Uh, and it's happening at Mount Pan Panorama. I bet you can the tracks anymore. It's Mount Panorama, okay? So, Mount Panorama. Uh, also known as Bathurst. Yeah, Bathurst. That's the real word, eh? Bar first. And shoot. Sure. It's climbing already. We have seven people that are watching. Guys, welcome. If you guys have any questions of the, uh, the great announcement for something you guys want to properly hear. Um, so, yeah. Koi questions. I know there's one person that always gives us questions. Is Mr. Psycho Sheep. I think he's going to watch and he's going to ask really great questions so um we're gonna actually talk now to mr jean pierre who is also known as blix and p and he's also the admins of gt sport sa jp my question to you now is what is gonna happen in season four how, how much, much do you want to know <laughs> that is the question that is also the question for myself yes but the viewers wants to know as well so my question to you first is what's going to happen in season four? So, definitely, definitely some racing and uh, obviously. obviously. And um, <laughs> anything from season four, I think the title is a dead giveaway. Like we talked about it being the season of the fours. Yes. So, um, I think we, we did drop a few stuff of. Um, Possible uh, team members, and uh, we'll we'll have all of that revealed and the, the specifics of that um, going into our live stream that's happening uh, two days from now and uh, Thursday. Yes, yes. And um, it would also be, being that we're speaking of teams, we would like the entire community team to uh, contribute to that live stream. Um, as it would uh, definitely be uh, a team effort, if you know what I'm saying. Um, going into the live stream, watching the comments. Um, no, we, uh, I haven't run this by the admins as of yet, but... Uh, I think, you know, if we, we see some good comments, have some people participate in the live stream, maybe getting them into our live voice chat, getting their opinions, um, ideas, um, I think that might be uh, a great initiative as well from our admins. What do you think, Werner? Uh, 
No, I completely agree with you, JP. I think uh, the exciting part of the season is that uh, the tracks and the cars that's going to be raced will be up to the community to vote for them exclusively. Um, yes. it, takes, it takes a lot of pressure off our admins because uh, it's very difficult to keep everyone happy. So um, this way we can have the most democratic way and the most votes will be the races that it's on. Oh, definitely. I love the way that you uh, put it with uh, the exclusivity for the community. Um, after all, I think with the absence of uh, Papa Jerry, uh, um, that's the whole idea that we started this community on as well, um, is to have the players involved. And um, I think throughout the year, um, I think you can talk from personal experience as well, um, all the initiative that we've received, not only from the admins that's currently there, um, the newly one doing the stream for us and having us interviewed, um, the initiative from the community where it stands now as far... I agree with you completely. What, what was a real breath of fresh air most, most recently was in the, uh, the participation in the library group where um, Stephen Berry took it upon himself to actually create a Facebook page, there's a WhatsApp group, and uh, the guys are sharing some awesome talent there in terms of their designs. Yeah, I've seen oh, it wow, there. that is terrific. I've seen it there, it's brilliant. I mean, these guys are showing their talent as well, not just for racing, but also to show their craftsmanship with their ideas on their minds, on the liveries and everything, and also showing their talent of replicas such as the touring cup that happened uh, how can i say 20 years ago i mean it's just it's astounding and now there's also a competition that is running now by uh is it steven i think uh yeah it's steven uh yeah he so runs it's a weekly comp. yeah it's a weekly competition that he runs now and he uh basically gives you the car with free liveries options and then the rest it's up to you but also the colors as well is also there so this week was it a Ford GT model and you have the main sponsors that are Ford engine and I think it's HGK uh, spark plugs and you have to design a awesome livery and then the, uh, Steven and his other admin will choose at the end of the week who has the best car and so far we have looked at very awesome cars I mean, it's just mind-blowing. Yeah, no, look, I'm, uh, I'm very excited about it. I'm excited about season four. So it is the season of fours. Yes, it is. So I think we can expect some four-wheel drive machines. Well, obviously. So we, uh, <laughs> we could be expecting some GR4 races. We, uh, yeah. You can just imagine anything with four, multiples of four. I don't want to give away too much. We'll yeah. have uh, we'll have more detail on Thursday. Yeah, Thursday is to get involved. Yes, Thursday is the main big event for the live stream where we will explain everything to you guys. And uh, I know you guys are waiting for the answer for season four, but it is going to happen this week, this Thursday. We are still making sure uh, where we're going to stream it, but possible it's going to be on YouTube. Possible it's going to be on Twitch. We don't know, but. We will find for you guys. Yes. It's, uh, we, we're definitely going to do a, a PlayStation live stream. Um, I was thinking of complicating it a bit more and involving Discord and, and doing a, a replay of previous races um, through YouTube. But uh, I think keeping it simple, um, doing a live stream on PlayStation, uh, it will be um, broadcasted uh, via YouTube. Um, links will be sent out, um, I think we can do it at least 10 to 15 minutes before the time, I'll see if I can uh, work some uh, computer magic and uh, put up a, a time delay for the stream and um, so that the guys can sit with anticipation and wait for our voices to show up. Um, they definitely, like I said, YouTube and um, I was just thinking when we mentioned and talking about Season of the Fours, four-wheel drive, group fours. Um, I was thinking instead, because it was mentioned that we, with the live stream, we're going to do a live update of the forum and details and everything. Um, 
But I think all the details will 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 try and update it every four minutes. Um, whatever we got, we'll update. Whatever the community uh, gets involved with, we will definitely update and keep it on as fast as possible as live updates. Um, so definitely those that are going to be watching the stream can definitely be, be looking at the forum as well, or those who just want to check out the forum, keep uh, those updates um, in, in, in their view. Yes, yes. So, yeah. And, uh, yeah, we also now have a Discord page as well. We are still looking how it works and everything, but it, the page is running, though. It is running. But we are still... How can I say? We're still newbies to working it. out the kinks. <laughs> yes. Uh, I'm just looking at the uh, uh, chat here. Psycho Sheep is asking here, where do uh, where do guys spend your mileage points? Uh, mileage points. Mine says full. Well, Psycho Sheep, oh, you can psycho. spend your. You can spend your mileage points on your tuning upgrades. I mean, it's on your car settings where you tune your car and uh, where you level your car up. That's where you spend it. And then even at the main menu, you will look at the page there. It says discover or mileage points, something there. I don't know, I forgot yes, the name. Mileage mileage exchange, I think. Yes, mileage exchange. There you, go. you go in there and you can buy rims, you can buy helmets, you can buy suits. You can even buy cars with your colors, mileage points. Cars. And it's unique colors. That's why people get their unique colors from. It's from that. That's why you use your mileage points app. Yeah. And <laughs> all right, all right. So Sheep is putting up his hand, saying, OK, OK. <laughs> so I'm just going to quickly give you guys a heads up of the Rally X here. We just give you, um, I'm going to run down with the championship points for you guys as well. No, no, down. But look who has Hello. joined! Oh, oh my goodness. goodness! He's finally joined! <laughs> He's, He's alive! alive. Papa so Jer, are you. are you alive, bro? I'm alive, I'm glad to see that Werner and John Pierre is also alive. <laughs> yeah, they were, yeah, yeah. yeah. they were, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So I just ran them a, a quick question through season 4. Uh, we don't want to give out too much because we're going to give to every viewer out there for for, two, uh, for Thursday, I mean. But um, what's your thoughts for season four, Mr. Papa Joe? I cannot wait. I tell you what, I cannot wait because for now, I will have a chance to get into the top. Great, 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 great hearing great. that That's from you. My, my team members will take me there. <laughs> <laughs> That's what you say, eh? That's what you say. Yeah, I know we've been looking forward to this for a long time. It's uh, It's been in the planning since, what, season two, eh, John Pierre? <laughs> yeah, yeah it's, it's, it's been in the planning, planning since, since season two. two. Um, I, I, I think, think I've, I've kind, kind of overplanned it. it. I, I wanted, wanted to... to do too, too much, much but, but uh, I, I think, think with, with our, our cool heads, heads we will definitely sort something, something out and like, like we mentioned previously with the input from the community, community we will uh, get, get something, something amazing done. Absolutely. Yes, I uh, just see uh, Cotis, please give me five minutes, don't start. Cotis, I will just wait for you just indeedly there, my friend. You have to come join as soon as possible because there's 14 drivers. 14 in this very race, so you have to hurry, bro. <laughs> okay, so I'm okay. gonna quickly go Not to uh, get the points quickly. So I'm gonna quickly minimize here quickly the screen. Uh, Rally X total points. Come, come. I almost lost my freaking darts on the PC today. Very terrible experience with that. Okay, so here's the rundown on the championships total point uh, overall. In first place is Valentino K1300, who is dominating the series. He's leaning the board with 72 points. Second place is Berti, who's also known as XMB Ferrara, with 52 points. 
Third place is Gambler69 in 38 points. Talky Thousand with 30 points. He's in uh, fourth place. Then you get Noel Graylin with at the fifth place at. Oh shit, there goes the connection. Whoa. There goes the connection. Okay, let's go back. Go <laughs> uh, okay, I was at fifth place with Noel Graylin at 22 points. Seventh, we have Quintus, or Quintas, 1986 with 20 points. Eighth place is Rens Kotzel, who is the other co founder of Rally X, who is at. 18th uh, points with 8th place. Ninth is Mr. Reverse Guy, Mr. Cartes at 18 points. Ballistic at 18 points with 10th spot. Uh, also at the 10th spot because they are both neck and neck is also Slayer R6 with 18 points. 11th spot is Ghost 7 78 with 16 points. 12th spot Wally 88 with 12 points. 13th spot is Hornout with 10 points and Jake's 14th is 8th Joe <coughs> is on 6 points with 15 spot <laughs> and then our our American friend Mr. Whiskey Jones is on 6 points he's finally in the GT Sport uh, points catalogue which is actually very good and then you know, uh, I, I just, just have to interrupt there. You know, yes, Mr. Yes. GT, Mr. Whiskey Jones is uh, an American friend, like you mentioned. And, yes, indeed. Uh, he, he has recently. Sorry, to hear that. sorry definitely sorry to hear that. And uh, we give him the benefit, the benefit of the doubt. Like he said, it's, it's his icebreaker. He's, he's, he's got uh, property in Etenacher. But uh, so it makes him kind of a South African. But 